This is Chuck Thaxton, Managing Director of Data Science and Research at ARC. And here's the latest update on air travel recovery in the US. We're seeing some really exciting progress in the recovery. ARC settled transactions for the latest week were down only 47% from 2019 levels. Still being led by online travel and leisure agencies, down only 35% from 2019. And we're even seeing some positive signs from business travel with the best weekly performance since the recovery began. But let's look at average ticket price. Looking at 2020 average ticket prices, they were much lower than historical norms and very volatile for several reasons. There were many fewer travelers and business travel essentially dried up. And in 2021 so far, economy tickets sold in the top 100 US markets started the year about 35% below historical norms. However, in the last few weeks, we've seen that gap shrink to about 25% below. There are still ticket deals out there, but those fares are starting to recover, just like ticket volumes are starting to recover. We see the same pattern in premium travel as well, and in outbound flights from the US to international destinations. We talked last month about travel to the Caribbean being very high. Those tickets started the year about 32% below historical norms and now are averaging only about 13%. Bottom line is average ticket prices are still a bargain, but that savings gap is starting to shrink as travel continues to recover. Next month, we'll continue to provide you updates on the latest information in the US air travel recovery.